Robert Louis Stevenson has said that don't judge each day by the harvest you reap but by the seeds that you plant. Now that is a deep statement. Despite how busy and complicated our lives may be, we should always strive to perform acts of kindness on a regular basis because not only it will benefit the people that we are being kind to, but also it will help us heal and feel better about ourselves. Let's try to be kind to everyone that we interact with. What's going on YouTube family? I am Chek Mbe and I want to thank you all for the continued support. My main purpose is to inspire you to be great, encourage you to be more kind and to restore your faith in humanity. If you haven't yet subscribed, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out the next time I upload. Comment what you think about this video and your favorite part and please give this video a thumbs up for the YouTube algorithm and really appreciate you guys for supporting my online merchandise store. Imagine traveling on a plane, going on vacation or to work and suddenly the pilot passes out unconscious and you see your life flashing. What will you do? Stand there? Pray? Cry? Or scream? I'm sure everyone would have a different answer. It takes a lot to actually be calm and make a good decision but I'm sure you would do anything possible to save your life. Meet this passenger named Darren Harris, who's 39 years old, on a small plane who had no previous experience flying, never took any kind of flight course, but somehow managed to save the plane from crashing. Thanks to the man who took him through this entire process. And the pilot was slumped over on the controls, and then they pushed him back. They, they get him out of his seat, and then they had to get on the controls and pull back the plane so that it would climb up out of the dive that it was in. Flying on a single engine Cessna plane from the Bahamas when the pilot was suffering a medical emergency and passed out, leaving Harrison, who again had no flying experience, to land the plane in Florida. The only other passenger on board was the pilot's friend. I'm not sure if some of you realize how dangerous this was. It could have ended so differently. This small plane was at 9,500 feet going 180 miles per hour when the flight data indicated that it was on a dramatic nosedive, dropping more than 3,000 feet in 15 seconds. Thank God this flight instructor named Bobby Morgan was there working an extra shift in the air traffic control towers at Palm Beach International Airport, Florida. Try to hold the wings level and see if you can start uh, descending. Bobby started talking to Harrison through the crisis, just from simple instructions, which Harrison followed shortly after he was able to make a perfect landing and the pilot was rushed to the hospital. But these two guys are truly amazing. By the time I had moved forward to the front of the airplane, I realized that we had now gone into a dive at a very fast rate. All I saw when I came up to the front was water out the right window and I knew it was coming quick, very, very quickly. At that point, I knew if I didn't react that, that we would die. This Blue Jays fan made this Yankee fan's day. Sometimes life is much deeper than just material object. Kids around the world are constantly showing us that people are inherently kind and genuine. This group of students pay a tribute to their late husband of their teacher with a picture of him on the blanket. This is so beautiful. You are never too young or too old to make an impact in this world. The legacy of this young boy, Joy, is now helping others get through tough times. The truth is, it is very hard to find meaning when you are going through difficult times. Three, four, five, and run! He was full of life from the get-go. This mom not only dedicates her time to help others with joy that was inspired by her beautiful son. He was happy while he fought. Mason Mazuka's energy is so contagious. His mom said Mason spread love and joy everywhere he went. In 2016, she received some tough news that her four-year-old son Mason have leukemia. Miss him every single minute. Um, he was my best friend. 
In 2018, after Mason sadly passed away, his mom Kelly turned her grief into a mission. Their main purpose is to support other children who need extra care and love. Since then, Kelly and her husband Bob opened up their home to eight foster children. She also started a nonprofit called Mason Strong Village. This organization honors Mason attitudes. Their community packed and give joy boxes to kids near the DC area hospitals with joy and other stuff that they need. Over 500 boxes were delivered. I got Legos. I love building Legos. To help other people that are going through this, she's a superwoman. I'm very grateful to her. That's a Minecraft one. Shelly Shield was one of Mason's good friends and said that this is what Mason would like. At the end of the day, we're helping someone in his name. Hi. Hi, Hudson. I'm Kelly. How you doing today? This is a very beautiful Honoring mom, her son's turning her pain into turning action that really matters. I will live every day doing this for Mason and all the other children that are faced with these unforeseen battles. Teachers around the world aren't given enough credit. They go above and beyond doing the impossible job. This incredible teacher came and visited a student and presented an award in person. This American rapper that go by Little Pump brings a handicapped man on stage. This is so beautiful, man. I don't think he will ever forget this experience. This man gets the best gift of his life and he just couldn't control it. His tears just start coming out. These ice skating couple have been teaming up together since they were kids for about 20 years. The relationship is so beautiful. My friends and family, if you made it up to this point in this video, you are a true legend. I want to take this time really to thank you so much for the privilege of your time. It honestly means a lot because these videos really take a lot of time to put together and to research. But the fact that you guys continue to support me really means a lot. But be sure to subscribe if you haven't yet so you don't miss out the next time I upload. Comment what you think about this video and your favorite part. And please give this video a thumbs up for the YouTube algorithm so more people will get a chance to actually see this video. And lastly. Don't forget to support my online merchandise store. This is how I actually save up money to perform acts of kindness like pay for strangers' groceries and help out the homeless. And as always, I'll see you on the next video. Peace.